In this part of Parma, a dry day is a good day. And a rainy day is more stressful than it needs to be. It is every single time. And I mean, every time it rains, we have to run in our basement and make sure nothing's flooded because we've lost thousands of dollars. Cassandra Norris and her husband, Stephen, have lived on Kruger for nearly a decade. And while the weather is inherently unpredictable, dealing with a flooded basement, we'll say 30 to 40 times, yeah. has almost become expected. When I pull the tiles up, all the flooring up, what did we find? Mold. Black mold everywhere. The sewer system that services this part of Kruger between 48th and 54th streets is in line for an overhaul. While still in the design phase, the city has applied for funding from the state and plans to cobble together other funding sources like regional sewer district grants to bring the project to reality. However, it won't be enough to keep the Norrises from moving to their new home in Seven Hills and putting the flooding behind. That's the biggest reason, aside from the fact that we have multiple kids and need more room. <laughs> but, but realistically speaking, if the flooding wasn't an issue, then people would be more determined to maybe put on an addition. Oh, yeah. We could, we could have added. We could, we we could have, have easily have done that. And she's a nurse, and I'm a tow truck driver, so, you know, it's not like uh, our money we're working hard for. So just to keep throwing it away is completely ridiculous. In Parma, Jordan Vandenberg, News 5.